hi guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here do forget to subscribe and hit that all bell notification in that way you will miss any time i publish a new video also to mention i started some new youtube channels so be sure to check them out in the description below all right so what are we going to be doing today well today we'll be heading into the kitchen and we're going to be doing some boiled veggies and provisions so let's get started pumpkin sweet potatoes and plantain okay so what i'm going to be doing is actually um boiling this pumpkin with the skin on so i'm going to clean my skin thoroughly so that i can do that because the skin does have nutrients in it so in today i'm not going to be peeling my pumpkin skin but i'm going to be using the pumpkin skin to eat So in order to flavor our water, we're going to use one of these no chicken stock cubes. And in that way, while we're boiling our vegetables and provision, we, we are able to um, get some flavor into it. Because when I'm finished, I am personally going to drain out the water. I'm not going to use the water. The reason being is because I've added sweet potato to this sweet potato is high in what is called oxalates and for persons who have kidney stones they want to avoid a diet that is high in oxalates because oxalates contribute to kidney stones so one way of reducing oxalates in an oxalate high food is to boil it and of course you won't want to use the water but if you don't have a problem with kidney stones, then you can actually use this flavored water after. You know, you can use it to, to put in soup or to put in chicken because you would have, you know, the, the, the flavored from the, the flavor rather from the chicken stock cube as well as from the vegetables and provisions. Um, so it's, it's, it's up to you. But this is an idea that if you want a flavor, your veggies when you're boiling it or your provisions this is a nice way of adding a little extra flavor to your veggies and provisions So guys, you notice how I strained my um, boiled provisions and veggies. I didn't empty it into the strainer, but I used the strainer to hold it back. So that's another way that you can strain out your things. Now, like I said, uh, you can use this um, as, um, you know, when you f for when you're cooking your meat or making your soup or whatever. But what I'm going to do, I'm gonna allow this to cool and I am going to, oh, there was something on my finger there. Yeah, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to allow this to cool. And I'm going to use it to water my plants in my garden. I cannot use this water because, like I said, sweet potato is high in oxalates. And I have to avoid anything that is high in oxalates. But um, 
at least you got an idea of how you can sort of um, amp up or add a little extra flavor for when you're boiling your veggies or provisions. Um, you can add the no stock cube to it and it will enhance the flavor of whatever you're boiling. So once again, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye for now.